numbers from these teams. Just wow. They are always looking to make that extra pass. And, you know, that kind of mentality, B.A., is contagious. It really goes a long way. Everybody buying in to not just getting a good shot, but going from good to better to best shot. Defense gets burned by Edwards' ball handling ability. I mean, this guy is athletic and can really move. And so it's Doncic with it. He brings it up for the Dallas Mavericks. And here's Jones. Here's Gafford. Doncic outside. Jacks up a three. And he buries his first look. Boy, what a high arcing shot from Doncic. Seemed like that one was never going to get to the rim after it left his hands. Now here's Conley. Kicks it out, Towns. It's Edwards on the wing. He's guarded by Irving. Just five to shoot. Shot is good by Edwards. And, you know, we need to keep seeing this from Edwards. It's encouraging to see him sink the mid-range J there. Doncic passes to Gafford. Pass to Washington. Over Towns. Oh, it's blocked by Towns. McDaniels against Jones. Left side, Edwards. Over Irving. And that one's long. And Dallas with possession. Washington passes to Irving. Puts it up from 12. And it's Gobert with a rebound. For Minnesota, they've gone two of three from the floor. It's Edwards on the wing. Pass to Towns. And that one, good. Superb focus from the big man. Carl Anthony Towns just brushing off that defense with ease. Again, the miss by the Mavericks. And it's good. Fought through contact, hit the shot, and will go to the line. Already growing a reputation as one of the game's most notorious trash talkers. Edwards is just having fun out there. Can they get it? Rebounded by the Timberwolves. Well, you will not see that from him very often, especially right at the rim. A quick shot there. It's off target. The Mavericks trailing. First quarter of basketball. Just over two and a half minutes played so far. Nice work defensively, meeting him up top and forcing the miss. Stolen by Jones. Right side, Irving. Let's it go from deep. Nails it from three. Kyrie Irving, what a touch from deep. And it's Conley with the ball for Minnesota. Pass to Towns. Outside Edwards. And Gafford with the block. McDaniels against Jones. First quarter of action, just under three and a half minutes played. With the floater. Oh, rejected by McDaniels. And that's out of bounds. Dallas will keep it. Clock at six. Here's Washington. And gets hacked by the D. He'll go to the line. 
savvy play that time on the part of Washington got his man in an awkward position and then drew the foul. And the first one at the line is good. A dependable stretch for Washington is also somebody who continues to look to improve every year in the league. And good on the second, so he makes them both. And we're just over three and a half minutes into this first quarter. Edwards with it. He's got seven. And it falls for him. He's now four of seven from the field. You know, confidence feeds on itself. And the more experience Edwards gets, I think the more confidence he'll continue to gain, especially operating in these pick and roll sets. Oh, great teamwork right there. Hey, you got to love the finish, bringing it down with some attitude. I tell you what, I think the pass was even better. I mean, that was room service delivery at its finest. Outside McDaniels. And Jaden McDaniels picks up the foul. That's his first foul of the game. And this kind of selflessness is great to see. Textbook positioning to draw the charge. Heads up action there. Reading the play and then beating him to the spot. Well done. Irving against Edwards. They now take the lead. Irving's got five. Always a threat on the drive. Irving has an explosive first step. Now Edwards. Nine points in the game. Here's Towns. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting. So he'll take two free throws. When Towns is hammering the inside, putting pressure on the defense, good things happen for this team. And a moment to check out the scoring breakdown for the Mavericks. To me, it's been the ball movement. That's been the key. I mean, going from good to great. Not settling for a good shot, making that extra pass, keeping the defense off balance, and taking great shots. And something else I've noticed is how they've been able to cause turnovers and take advantage of them on the offensive end, not wasting those extra chances at all. You can tell Towns is a true modern-day player. He's got a diverse skill set, and he can do so much more than you're used to seeing from a guy his size at his position. And so Towns nails them both. Two-part equation. You have to be aggressive enough to get to the line, then talented enough to sink them. Pass to Washington. And here is Irving. He's got five. Two points. That one goes. He has seven. Hey, the skills of Kyrie are obvious, but what isn't so obvious is his underestimated strength. Irving against Edwards. And his fifth basket. Now five for eight. Looking comfortable out there. Trading the lead back and forth. Neither side is willing to back down. Yeah, and the lead has changed hands, and it just hasn't stayed in those hands very long when it's changed. Back and forth we go. Irving against Edwards. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. Towns finds Edwards. Pass to Conley. Now Gobert. Goes up at the elbow. Jones grabs the board. And so it's Jones who brings up the ball for the Dallas Mavericks. They trail by one. Washington outside. That shot is off. And some solid defense from Towns. 
Conley against Doncic. Ooh, rejected by Doncic. Luka's sheer size makes him a mismatch for most guards. And the Timberwolves making a change here. McLaughlin's checked in. Here's Towns. Get through, get through, get through. Pass to Edwards. Back to Daniels. Six on the shot clock. Over Irving. Second shot opportunity. With the clock winding down. And that's two points on the layup. Making the save. McDaniel secures the rock and gets the second chance look. Now a timeout called by Dallas. Failing to find a rhythm offensively. Something that needs to change and change soon. And I think this timeout, guys, is where you draw up some plays that are guaranteed to create some high percentage shots. Some changes for Minnesota. Anderson comes in for Towns. And it's Alexander Walker in for McDaniels. Kleba, he's checked in for the Mavericks. Exum comes in for Irving. And the Mavericks with possession here. It's a three-point game. Hardaway, the pass to Doncic. Here's Lively. Pass to Kleba. For three, Hardaway. Always a nice way to start. Makes his first one. This is Hardaway's game. A quick trigger shooter who wants to score as often as possible. For Minnesota, they've gotten 7 of 13 shots to drop. Here's Edwards. The Mavericks pull it in. Here's Exum. Doncic with it. Fires the three. Edwards pulls it in. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. Can't hit the free-throw line jumper. That's a decent look for him. He just couldn't convert. Doncic feeling it out a bit. Here's Lively. And he banks in the layup. Second-chance points are always painful. Have to make the effort to box out. Hey, guys standing around spectating. I mean, you got to get in there and get tough. Here's McLaughlin, guarded by Doncic. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. First free throw is good. And some changes here for the Timberwolves. Reed's checked in for Gobert. And it's Morris in for Edwards. And Dallas with a change here too. Hardy, he's checked in for Doncic.
And so he hits both. Dallas has gone three of six shooting from beyond the arc. Here's Exum. Still no points. Pass to Kleba. Five to shoot for three. Hardy. Alexander Walker grabs the board. The shooter thought he had enough space, but the defender was right on him. You know, that's a trademark of his defense. Quick to react, close down the shooter, and then affect the shot. And once more this half, they find a way to get great position inside. Here's Exum. From down in the low post, it goes. The Timberwolves have gotten 8 of 16 attempts to fall. Here's McLaughlin. Inside. A slam dunk by Reed. He may give up a little size, but has the bounce to hold his own. Here's Hardy. Pass to Exum. From deep three-point range, the long-distance three is buried. Exum's got five points. Well, it's certainly been a roller coaster ride. <laughs> you do me one, I'll do you one better. It feels like we have a lead change every few possessions. And <laughs> just terrible defense. I don't know how he missed that shot. 151 left to play in the first quarter. These calls can be so difficult for officials to make. Yeah, but in this case, I think he got it right. I mean, the defender was still moving there and never really had good legal guarding position. He wasn't set. The Mavericks making a switch here. Green is checked in. One forty-four left to play in the first quarter. Count it. Want to score in the NBA? Picks can really force the D to make tough choices. The Timberwolves trail. Here's Alexander Walker. No points yet. Pass to Reed. Let's go with a three. And it falls. Two for three from the field so far. And that's what they want to do. Get him open looks early. Outside Hardaway. No good that time. Nice D from Anderson. Minnesota's gone one or two from three-point land so far. Here's McLaughlin. Here's Alexander Walker. No good on the three. And that's a strong closeout defensively. Great effort to deter the shot. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. Yeah, and you never want to let shots at the rim go uncontested. Yeah, I couldn't agree with you more. I mean, that's the message they were sending with that foul. Nothing easy inside. Shooting two. The first free throw is good. And the Mavericks making a change here. Powell's checked in. And he can't hit the second. And here's Minnesota now. They trail by one. McLaughlin. Oh, great D that time from Powell. Dallas has gone four of eight from outside in this first quarter. Here's Hardy. Guarded by Morris. And Powell with the stuff. Got to give it up for Powell now. I mean, he excels at rising off the ground 
to punch home these alley-oops. Seven second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. McLaughlin passed to Alexander Walker. Knocks down the long J. There's 21 seconds left in the first. Now here's Hardaway. Three-pointer. No good on the buzzer beater. Tie game in Minnesota. Let's take a quick break, and then it's on to the second quarter after this. And we hope you're enjoying the game. Both teams tonight keeping things pretty even on the scoreboard so far. All right, let's quickly break down the game. What we've seen so far from the Timberwolves, guys. It's simple. When you can protect the rim the way they have, it's a big advantage. Yeah, you know, you have a guy in there blocking a bunch of shots or multiple players blocking shots. It causes the offense to think twice when they go up for shots in there. Well, Clark, with teams playing at such a fast pace now, it's often a choice between transition defense and offensive rebounding. I think that's somewhat true. I think that was always a choice, but even more so today. I think you're right, Brian, because teams now are playing typically at a faster pace. I always value the ability to get second shots. I think you can balance the floor defensively, but I think rebounding on the offensive end still has to be part of how you attack, especially if you've got guys that are good offensive rebounding. They have their two big men out there, Towns and Gobert, working inside. Nikhil Alexander-Walker out there with Mike Conley. And it's McDaniels in at the small forward position. That's the five to begin the second quarter for the T-Wolves. And let's send it over to Ali LaForce. Anthony Edwards carries a swagger about him. He said, quote, I am the most confident person in the world. I've always felt like I'm the best at everything I did. Coach Finch said, quote, he is super confident, he's real, and he's genuine. A lot of guys have a confidence that hides an insecurity. He is not that. He knows who he is as a person and as a player. Brian? Yeah, great point. Thank you, Allie. The Mavericks leading. Washington outside. Takes a three. And it's Gobert with a rebound. Gobert's got six rebounds in the game. Here's Alexander Walker. Washington grabs the miss. The Mavericks have gone just one of three to begin the second quarter. And Irving, the bucket on the assist by Washington. Now it's a four-point Maverick lead. Boy, an excellent passer for a big man. P.J. Washington's floor awareness, impressive. Doncic against Conley. 4-3. The shot by Alexander Walker, no good. Here's Green. Lays it up and in on the nice reverse. Green's got five points. You got to appreciate Kyrie Irving's court awareness. Outstanding finding open teammates. Connolly with the ball. Picked up. Ooh! alley you finish with authority by Gobert. Great lob and an even better finish by Gobert. Pass to Washington. And go bear with a block. And they'll keep possession. Now McDaniels. Green covering. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. The length that McDaniels brings gives him an advantage against a smaller defender. Sometimes drawing a foul like he did there. The first one falls. Guys like McDaniels, who can guard just about any position on the floor, extremely valuable these days. 
Anthony Edwards has checked in for Alexander Walker. Gafford, he's checked in for the Mavericks. Exum comes in for Green. No good on the second, so he hits one of two. The Mavericks have got three of six shots to go here in the second quarter. Washington finds Doncic. Washington outside from deep. Drills it from deep. He's got seven. Well, you can see the focus Washington has right there. The defense right on top of him. He doesn't let that bother that jump shot of him. Conley looking for an opening. Doncic with a block. Now for those joining us now, we're in the second quarter, about three minutes gone by. Washington against Conley. Towns down low over Doncic. Towns can't get it to go. Oh, gritty defense. Protecting the rim at all costs against a guy who has all sorts of ways to finish. To the middle. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. That one on Doncic. Well, I like the way Towns plays such a physical style. It's tough on the officials, but the fact that he doesn't mind initiating contact gets him to the strike. And that one falls for Towns. It's both from the stripe. Well, he's certainly been on target with the free throws. Such an advantage when your bigs can knock them down time from out, the line. Out. Time called here. The Mavericks decide to talk it over. And here in the second quarter of action as we approach four minutes played. And here's Doncic outside. McDaniels with the rebound. Minnesota's gone 0 for 2 from outside in the second quarter. Gets it to go. That makes him 2 for 3 in this game. What a move by McDaniels showing the defense how nimble he is when he wants to be. Irving with it. He's picked up by Conley with a step back. No good. A bit long that time. Well, that's a good player missing from point blank range. That's one you got to convert. The kick out to Edwards. Conley up top. Shot clock at six. 
over Irving. And he hits it to tie the game. <laughs> a savvy playmaker with a great handle. Conley runs such a smooth pick and roll. Here's Exum. McDaniels covering. Oh, and Towns with the block. <laughs> Man, the defender really went after him. Yeah, if you're going to foul, then make sure that you don't give a chance for the and one. And he makes the first. Second free throw, no good. And Towns has got the ball here for Minnesota. McDaniels inside. Washington's there. McDaniels can't hit. Dallas has gone one for three from downtown here in the second. And stolen by Edwards. Oh, it's stolen away. Going inside. And he lobs it up top. And the dunk by Gafford. The great read between those two guys. The defense didn't stand a chance, B.A. These two teammates right here, Grant, they are connected. And I tell you what, guys, that's a big play to make in a close game. Potential momentum builder there. Edwards can't hit. The Mavericks have gone just 5 of 12 here in the second quarter. Irving, no good. Showing great intensity around the rim is part of why he's a respected defender. And you know what? He's not going to give up an easy finish at the rim. I mean, that's just uh, against his constitution. Conley passes to Towns. Six to shoot. McDaniels with it. Checked by Washington. McDaniels, that's good. Like the determination. McDaniels not backing down. Dallas has gone 5 of 12 from three-point range tonight. Doncic passes to Gafford. Here's Exum. Five points in the game. Doncic outside. The three is up. Oh, Luka with a deep one. Prolific from deep. Luka, one of the best in the game right now. The Timberwolves trail. Outside Edwards. Pass to Towns. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Towns has got eight points. He does not lack for confidence, and he shouldn't. I mean, this guy is a dangerous scorer. Doncic with it. Six points for him. Here's Doncic. Second chance effort. And it's good on the layup. Doncic has got five points now in the quarter. Boy, there is no quit in Doncic. He competes timeout, every timeout. play, every game. Now a timeout called by Minnesota. Adjustments are a part of every game and every quarter of a game. I think Coach sees something here. And you know what? We'll see what changes he makes coming out of this timeout.
And some changes here for the Timberwolves. Reed's checked in for Rudy Gobert. Anderson comes in for McDaniels. And it's Morris in for Conley. Back to Morris. Pass to Reed. And that makes him three for four. He's looking good. Nice move to get inside and create a good look for himself. Now here's Kleba. Back to Hardaway. Battles through traffic and lays it in. Hardaway's got his second basket of the night. Boy, Hardaway Jr. is a competitor now, showing you some real toughness. He's not going to give you an inch. He's going to fight you to the finish. Here's Anderson. Buries it down low. Anderson's got his first points of the night. Dallas has gone two of four from the perimeter in the second so far. Exum passes to Lively. Yep, count it. And the Mavericks lead by four. Man, what a pass that was there. He really, really relishes making the game easier for his teammates. Down low. Reed. Mavericks with a rebound. Now Doncic. Give him eight. To the inside. Here's Kleba. Unable to get that one. And some solid defense from Towns. Morris on the wing. Up top, Edwards. With the 10-footer, shot clock at 5. Here's Towns. And it's powered home by Towns. And, you know, for all his perimeter skills, Towns also bringing that physicality inside. And there's the lob. And finished off by Kleba. <laughs> Beautiful setup on the alley-oop. Great catch, great flush. Well, I tell you what, that's the play we'll remember if they can put together a little surge to break this game open. Pass to Reed. Launches a three. And he gets it to go. Four for six so far. Nice read by Edwards there. Finding a wide open teammate and sending the ball his way on target. Exum gets the bucket. Exum's got seven points in the game. Need to do more than that to keep him from getting the ball in the post. Exactly. I mean, deny him the ball in the first place. Don't let him get it. Anderson doesn't go that time. Dallas has gotten six of 13 shots to go from outside the arc. Here's Exum. Good efficiency. He's drained four out of five. Minnesota has gone one of four from three-point land here in the second. Pass to Reed. The three is up. It's hauled in by Exum. Yeah, you know, he usually makes you pay from that range. A minute 39 left to play in the first half of basketball. Off the left rim and out. And so it's Towns with it. He brings it up for Minnesota. Back to Anderson. Nice dish, and the layup goes down. Anderson's got four points in the quarter. Excellent tempo on the play, and he leads his teammate perfectly. And here's Doncic. Give him eight points now. Here's Exum. Nice D from Reed. I think he'll think twice about attempting that shot next time. The defense was right on top of him there. Shot is good by Edwards. And it's now just a one-point Dallas lead. Yeah, you know, once Edwards flips that switch, now he stays fully engaged. His offensive arsenal is on full display. Hardaway, the pass to Lively. Pass to Doncic. Here's the three. Edwards pulls it in. Minnesota shooting around 50% of the game so far. And that misses. That would have put him up. Five-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. Hardaway against Edwards. Kleba outside. 
Here's Exum. To the paint. Here's Doncic. Oh, Luca, Like a bull in there. Doncic has it all. Full package. Soft hands that time made the floater look easy. Here's Edwards. Again, the miss by Edwards. And so a close game as we wrap up the first half of play. Mavericks ahead. They lead by three. Well, now a minute to check in with Allie LaForce. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. I'm here with P.J. Washington. P.J., what will be the key for you guys defensively in the second half? Uh, not letting them get easy routes to the basket and uh, contesting their shots, rebounding, and uh, just not letting them get second chance points. Comes back to the fundamentals, guys. Thanks very much, Allie. We'll be back soon to start the second half of basketball. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello, basketball fans. What a pleasure it is to bring you into the 2K studios again. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jet Smith. The first quarter for the Mavericks was fairly even. The period wrapped up with the teams on level ground and the score tied. They were slightly better in the second. Not a big difference between these two teams. And Kenny, what are your thoughts on how Dallas played? You know every team talks about playing unselfishly. And in the first half, it didn't look like there was an ego on this team. Now, looks can be deceiving, but the assist totals back up what we saw. Shaq, what do you think about Minnesota? I like their commitment to getting to the line. Their aggressive approach is frustrating the defense. I like that. They're drawing fouls at a very high rate. I like that. Wouldn't be surprised if someone gets ejected. I will like that, too. And that wraps up the halftime show. Third quarter set to begin in just a few. Second half of basketball is upon us, and we may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game we've seen so far. Boy, you got to like what we're seeing from Anthony Edwards. Through the first two quarters, he's been on fire. Explosive offensive performance. And you know what? I'll be interested to see just how much he's got left in the tank. That first half had to take a lot out of and as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard. On the court right now for Dallas, Luka and Kyrie are the talented backcourt. Derek Jones is out there with P.J. Washington, and it's Gafford in at the center position. No let up at all. Doncic, relentless. He's going to get his. You can count on it. Here's Edwards. And Gafford with the block. They get it back. McDaniels passes to Conley. Doncic against Conley. Now here's Doncic. Irving for three. The shot is good. Doncic making the play. Doncic has got his third assist of the night. The Timberwolves trail. Conley finds McDaniels. And with a little over a minute gone by, the second half is underway. Washington passes to Gafford. And the dunk by Gafford. Love the energy here in the third. Trying to take control now of this contest. And I really think this is the time to do it because this is a real important juncture in the ballgame right here. Gobert. And the shot goes in. Gobert's gotten his second bucket of the game. This is what the team relies on Gobert for. Clearing the glass and finishing the play. Dallas has gone 7 of 15 from distance in this game. Reed against Washington. Outside Irving. Down to five on the shot clock. From deep, here's Doncic. Rebounded by the Timberwolves. And he almost made them regret defending him so loosely. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That one on Doncic. The defense tries to stop Conley with a foul, but he shows great poise and manages to get it off. Oh. 
Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. The free throw drops for Conley. Yeah, one of the best leaders in the NBA. This team loves having Mike Conley in their locker room. Carl Anthony Towns has checked in for the Timberwolves. And Conley drops them both. Dallas has gone one of two shooting from the perimeter since halftime. Doncic against Conley. Fader on the way. Here's Jones. And he jams it home with authority. And their offensive rebounding is such a strength for them when he's on the floor. Yeah, he really helps them extend possessions, doesn't he? And you know, those second chance opportunities can be game changers. He represents so much value to this team because of what he does. The defense couldn't collapse quickly enough. And so it's Irving with it. He brings it up for the Mavericks. Six point lead. It doesn't go for him. Ooh, great D that time from Gobert. Here's Edwards. And Edwards slams it in. Boy, the athleticism of Edwards is something to behold. Love watching him sky up to throw it down. Here's Doncic. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. It goes on Mike Conley. And he knocks down the first one. Luka Doncic is a do-it-all player. I mean, he does everything for this team, including being a walking triple-double threat on a game-by-game -game basis. Doncic hits them both. The Timberwolves have gone three of seven here in this third quarter. Outside Edwards. Pass to Gobert. Outside Conley. McDaniels from long range. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Washington's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. He sends it home with some passion. I think he's rubbing it in a little bit here. Hanging up there like that. Guys, they're not backing off at all, are they? Conley passes to McDaniels. Here's Towns. He's guarded by Washington. Towns, that's good. Towns has got 12 points in the game. And I'm trying to think of how many seven-footers I know with that level floater in their arsenal. It's a short roll call list, folks. Pass to Washington. Over Towns, Washington's shot is good. He's got 10. The Timberwolves have gone four of nine in the third quarter. Doncic against Conley. And Gafford with the block. Tries again. Gobert, no good. The Mavericks have gone six for nine in the half. Pass to Gafford. And the shot counts. He's fouled, and it's a chance for a three-point play. All right, let's take a look at the energy stats, how the hustle game has been going for the Mavericks. Phenomenal work on the defensive end so far. That stands out the most. They've made it their mission to block shots and make things hard for the opposition. And we also got to talk about the number of points they've scored in transition, just jumping all over the opposition in this regard.
Irving, no good on the free throw. Hey, it's so amazing to see how much raw talent Kyrie Irving has. Just seems like that ball is part of it. Gives us a chance to catch up with Allie LaForce. Brian Commissioner Adam Silver has done a 180. Once in favor of raising the NBA age limit to 20, he now supports lowering it back to 18. He said it's the right thing to do, adding that the opportunity to work with players at a younger age on not just skills, but mental health, diet, character, and values could be in everyone's best interest. Yay? Well, it didn't happen yet, Allie. We'll see. Back to Alexander Walker. Over green. And he sinks that one, hitting the back of the rim on the way in. Alexander Walker's got five points. A very high percentage look when the D is nowhere to be seen. Irving for three. Minnesota with a rebound. Gobert's got the glass covered here tonight. That's 11 boards for him. Here's McDaniels. Banked it in off the glass. Nine points in the game. One of the league's better floor generals, really over the last decade, kindly plays with an old-school pass-first mindset. Towns against Washington. Outside Irving. Pure from three-point range. Irving's got 11 points here in the second half. Their strategy has been pretty simple here in the second half. Attack from three-point range. Certainly. I mean, they saw a weakness in the perimeter defense and took advantage of it. Here's Green. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. Free throw good. Green. And the Timberwolves making a change here. McLaughlin's checked in. So he hits one of two from the strike. And for the Timberwolves, they're shooting 40% since the break. On the wing, Alexander Walker. Money from the wing. Alexander Walker's got four points now in the quarter. And so it's Irving with it. He brings it up for the Dallas Mavericks. Pass to Powell. Back to Irving. From 12 feet. Rudy Gobert with a rebound. Gobert's got a rebound number 12 here already in the game. McDaniels against Irving. Towns up top. Launches it. And he drains it. A solid five for six now. Hey, a confident shooter like Towns doesn't need any time to get a shot up. And Dallas calls time here. Yeah, coach no doubt wants to use this timeout to review the matchups and maybe make some adjustments as well. Yeah, and I agree. I think there's going to be a new wrinkle in their game plan when they come out of this timeout.
Anderson's checked in for McDaniels. And Dallas also making a switch. Hardaway's checked in. Here's Hardy. Hasn't gotten one to fall yet. Takes the three. They get it again. And it's flushed down. A nice jam. And I just love how he's making the effort plays that everyone around him appreciates. It is certainly making an impact tonight. Well, you know, if you're not going to take care of the defensive glass, it's going to be hard to come away with the win. Alexander Walker, the pass to Gobert. Towns for three. Another shot. And it goes. As the official calls the foul, count it, and he'll shoot one more at the line. You know, he gets there so often, Gobert would like to make these at a higher clip. Dallas has gotten three of six threes to fall in the third quarter. Pass to Powell. Here's Lively. Here's Hardy. Still without a bucket. Just five on the clock. Here's Hardaway. And it's rebounded by Carl Anthony Towns. Towns has got a rebound number 10 tonight with that last one. The Mavericks leading. Here's Hardy. Outside Hardaway. Here's Lively. Minnesota with a rebound. Here's Alexander Walker. Pass to McLaughlin. Parked it down low that time. Got hit with the three-second call. Reeds checked in for the Timberwolves. This is why you want ball movement and player movement. And that's made it hard for the defense to key in on any one individual. Powell finds Green. To the middle. Lively shot is off. The Timberwolves trail. Here's Alexander Walker. Rebounded by Green. Dallas is shooting at 49% so far in the game. Here's Hardy. It's tipped. Ooh, lots of contact on the shot. So two free throws will follow that whistle. And that's going to be a foul on Minnesota. First one falls for him. The Timberwolves making a switch here. Morris has checked in. Good on both. So it's Minnesota now. Nine-point game. To the inside. Anderson lays it up and in off the pretty assist. Anderson's got six points. 
Terrific design and execution, leading to an opportunity right at the rim. I love great defense. Just quick to establish his feet, and he takes the hit. And not afraid to put his body on the line either. He took a shot for the team in that situation. And so it's Minnesota with it. High arcing shot, and he lays it in. Now just a five-point Dallas lead. Boy, that was a sweet-looking teardrop. There's very little defense for that. Green with the ball. Six points for him. Reed with the rebound. A minute 53 left to play in the third quarter here. The shot's good. Morris has got his second bucket of the night. I love the throwback basketball. Work it down low and set up your teammate. Hardy, the pass to Lively. Using his post moves to get the two points. Lively's got four points this quarter. Good decision making. Scopes the situation, puts the pass right on the mark. Here's Alexander Walker. Hits the trifecta. His three-point shot looks so pure. The defense allowing him to get comfortable out there. Pass to Lively. Now Green. From downtown. Anderson pulls it down. Great job of closing the space and getting a hand up. And, you know, he's a guy who knows how to defend the three-point shot. He's not going to just give it to you. He's going to make you earn it. Dallas has gone three of seven from deep so far in the third quarter. Here's Lively. Pass to Powell. 46 seconds left in the third quarter. Outside, Green. And the three-pointer goes. Green's got nine. Such an effective shooter. If you lose track of him defensively, he's going to make you pay. Morris outside. A slam dunk by Reed. Yeah, these teams are playing with incredible energy. Perhaps the case simply that some kind of motivational speeches at halftime got both of these teams fired up. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. Hardy's shot is good. Simple. The closer you are to the hoop, the better your chance to score. And so Morris will bring it up for the Minnesota Timberwolves. Powell pulls it in. Outside Hardaway. One second left. And the miss. Three quarters of play and a close one here. The Mavericks on top. Up three. And we're coming back in just a moment. Get ready for the fourth quarter when we return. And with three quarters behind us, we'll start the fourth in what is still anybody's ball game. And Minnesota has possession. They trail by three. Edwards at the two with McDaniels at the three. Inside, we got Towns and Gobert. And it's Conley in at the one. So that's the lineup for Minnesota. Up again, controls the rebound and the putback. And the Mavericks with possession here. They lead by one. Irving, the pass to Gafford. Now Irving. Oh, there's the alley! Jones against McDaniels. Pass to Conley.
Here's Towns to take the lead. That one's good. And it's Conley who picks up the assist. Conley's got three assists now in this one. Doncic passes to Gafford. Jones with the ball. Washington outside. Fires from deep. Minnesota with a rebound. McDaniel's got four rebounds now. Pass to Conley. Gobert with it. Defended by Jones. Now McDaniels. Clock at six. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Inside. Here's Doncic. Up and over Conley. Nice finish from Luka. Luka combination of finesse and bully ball in there that time. And here's Conley. And we're about two minutes into the fourth here. And Gobert with the stuff. A beautiful setup on the alley-oop. Great catch, great flush. Well, I tell you what, that's the play we'll remember if they can put together a little surge to break this game open. Got it. I got a question for you. How do you defend Irving in the pick and roll? He's so quick, and his ball handling is so good. Absolutely virtually impossible from 11 feet away oh rejected by Doncic pushing it up now and there's a whistle he'll head to the line to shoot two it's going to be on Carl Anthony Towns and even from where we're sitting you could clearly tell it was a foul no question about it I mean a ton of contact and a good call by the officials And he drops the first. Both free throws good from Irving. For Minnesota, they've gotten three of seven attempts in this fourth quarter to fall. Here's Edwards. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. Edwards does not back down. Even if it means taking physically hard contact, he's fearless. Shooting two. First free throw is good. Both free throws good for Edwards. A little over two and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. Pass to Washington. Now here's Irving. From deep. Drops in the three. Irving's got 18 points now here in the second half. Yeah, he's in his bag from beyond the arc right now. You see his confidence. Yeah, I'd be confident, too, as a matter of fact. I mean, if you're stacking up threes the way he is, I mean, he's doing all his work from behind the arc. And Minnesota calls time here. Kyrie Irving really making a difference here. He's on another level right now. Knocking down threes left and right. The defense isn't doing their job, and I think they've got to talk about it quickly.
All right, let's get a report from Allie. I was able to listen in on what Chris Finch was going over with his team. He likes the way they're finishing inside. Coach said when we get close, we are golden. They can't stop us in there. Let's keep pounding it as long as we can. As always, Allie, we thank you. McDaniels passes to Towns. Here's Edwards. And he wills that one in, sinking it right through the back of the iron. Edwards has got 21 points in the game. Dallas has gone one of two from deep in this quarter. And he's going for the oop here. Oh, what a nice defensive play to disrupt the lob. Fourth quarter of play, and over three and a half minutes have gone by now. Ooh, Washington with the defensive effort. Here's Jones. That one falls. Great setup by Doncic. Doncic has got his fourth assist with that last one. And so it's Conley who brings up the ball for the Minnesota Timberwolves. Towns against Washington. Now here's McDaniels. Not a lot of room. Towns for three. Count that one. He's eight for ten from the field now. One of the all-time shooting bigs. Towns is a marksman from deep. Irving with it. And it's Gobert picking him up. It's blocked by Gobert. Irving against Edwards. Over Irving. It's McDaniels on the wing. Oh, easy two for Gobert. Best of luck to any defender trying to slow Gobert down. He is ruthless inside. Pass to Washington. Back to Doncic. Puts up a deep three. The rebound by the Timberwolves. Towns has got 13 rebounds in the game. Glass heating. Now Edwards. Here's Conley. He's guarded by Washington. Throws it up high. Sort of defining the term floor general. Conley has total command of this offense. For Dallas, they've gone four of seven from the field in the fourth quarter. Irving against Edwards. To halt the run. And the shot's good by Irving. Irving's got 29 points. In a tight one like this, you have to trust in his ability. Yeah, I agree with you, Greg. I mean, he plays with no fear, and he certainly knows how to put the ball in the basket. Pass to Gobert. Down low. The 11-footer. And there's Conley. That one's good. And the assist from Gobert. Now, this is just too easy for Conley. The D can't allow him to get this close to the basket. Back to Irving. Inside. Here's Washington. And Washington powers it through. This has been the story of the game. A battle fought on offense. Any lull in the action so far has been short-lived because there have been nothing but buckets in this one. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for the Timberwolves. The way they've been able to consistently get past the defense and to the cup has been most impressive. They've almost made it look pedestrian. Also, lots of hustle on the offensive Shoot end. Two. Following shots and creating tons of second chance opportunities. The first free throw is good. And so Towns nails them both. The Mavericks have gone six for nine here in the fourth quarter. Pass to Jones. Here's Gafford. Now here's Doncic. Washington with the ball. Five on the clock. Takes it inside. And Gobert with a block. 
He's led the league in blocks before. No surprise Gobert sent that shot back. Jones against McDaniels. Jones with some nice D. I wonder if switching baskets really threw him off. I mean, because he can't get anything to fall this half. Doncic passes to Washington. Now Gafford. Doncic outside. For three. Second chance shot. Oh, and Towns with the block. With that reach, Towns is going to get his fair share of block shots. There's no doubt about that. McDaniels against Jones. Gafford grabs the miss. Gafford's got seven rebounds in the game. Here's Jones. Rudy Gobert with a rebound. Gobert's got his 18th rebound here tonight. All over the place. Outside McDaniels. Pass to Gobert. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Jones has got four rebounds now. Doncic left side. Stolen by Conley. Now here's Towns. Guarded by Doncic. They get it again. Ooh, Gobert in traffic connects. That's about all you can do if you're the defense. I mean, Gobert's solid at making Time tough shots. Out. And Dallas calls time here. Coach is not happy with their effort on the defensive glass. They're giving up way too many second chance points. time now to present our new balance player of the game Carl Anthony Towns and you know what this has been his game from the start I mean he found ways to impact at both ends and he's been relentless at attacking the opposition all night long keeping constant pressure on the opponent Hardaway's checked in for Irving Outside Hardaway. Pass to Jones. And here's Gafford. Outside Hardaway. Shot clock at six. Dallas needs to get off a shot. And Doncic launches from deep. Offensive rebound. Gafford. And the layup is good off the glass. Excellent activity and timing on the offensive glass. That's how you get extra possessions. Conley passes to Edwards. That one's good. And it's Conley who picks up the assist. Conley's got six assists now in the game. And Dallas calls time here. You have to like what we're seeing from Carl Anthony Towns. He's really taking it to him inside. They got to find a way to slow him down.
to the middle. Here's Hardaway. Edwards pulls it in. And just not allowing the shooter to get comfortable from mid-range. As a defender, he's going to just be a bothersome, worrisome guy. Hit. Making That's you miserable all night. A hand in your face Hit. on every jump. Shot. Honestly, I don't know how he pulled that off. And that was not a soft foul he had to get through. I mean, he had to really power that one up and in. Mind the lanes. Mind the lanes. One shot. And the free throw, no good. The Mavericks have gotten seven of 16 attempts to drop since the start of the fourth. Doncic with it. Towns covering. Luka against resistance. Well, you look at Luka's body. He doesn't look defined, but he's much stronger than he appears, and he showed it right there. Edwards, the pass to Gobert. Pass to Conley. The Mavericks pull it in. Doncic has got eight rebounds in the game. To the inside. Gafford. The shot is good. Doncic making the play. And now just a five-point Minnesota lead. Luka's peripheral vision off the charts. Get wide open, and he's going to find you. And it's Edwards with the ball for Minnesota. Their biggest lead of the game was nine. Here's Conley. There's another rebound. And he hauls in his 20th rebound. Oh, <laughs> just dominating the glass. Kicks it out, Towns. Five to shoot. Doncic pulls down the board. Doncic has got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Rebound, Minnesota. Outside, McDaniels. Washington grabs the miss. Dallas has gone one for five shooting from the arc here in the fourth. Hardaway, the pass to Washington. And here's Doncic outside. Nails it from beyond the arc. Doncic has got 11 points here in the second half. He's such a clutch shooter. He just lives for the big shot. Up top, Edwards. Defended by Hardaway. Goes up from the block. Count it! And talk about stepping up in a big way. Well, that was one-two. He wanted the ball. Nobody else was taking that shot. Doncic outside. Cash! And he's brought them within two points now. Get used to seeing this, folks. Doncic taking the moment head on and delivering. Oh, he nails it! Seems like Edwards never stops competing and believing right until the final bus. And Dallas calls time here. They're losing by four. And we've got 28 seconds left in the final quarter.
Reeds checked in for Gobert. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Here's Doncic. And it's in. Time out, time and out. he's brought them within two points now. No Wait. better guy to take the big shot. Luka completely unfazed. Timeout called the Timberwolves. They lead by two. We've got 22 seconds left in the game. And so it's Minnesota with it. Their biggest lead of the game was nine. And they commit an intentional foul. We'll see another one of those, so they get into the penalty. Yeah, just trying to keep this game alive. Not a bad foul right there. Sure, it's not over. The clock is as much a problem for them as the score is right now, so they've got to try to manage it. Now a timeout called by Minnesota. They're on top by two. 20 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter. Twenty seconds left in the fourth. And now they decide to foul intentionally. throws good and that makes it a three-point lead and this is where leaders come through Ken Edwards cash in at the strike we'll see so he goes two for two at the line and it's a four-point ball game and that makes it a two possession game now those could turn out to be vital free throw and so it's Doncic with it he brings it up for the Mavericks pass to Hardaway from deep three-point land rebounded by the Timberwolves Great job of closing the space and getting a hand up. And, you know, he's a guy who knows how to defend the three-point shot. He's not going to just give it to you. He's going to make you earn it. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. He 
He hits the first one. And that puts him up five. So he gets them both. And it's a six-point ball game. That should put this game on ice, not leaving any points behind. For three, Hardaway. And that bucket's good. So it's a narrow victory for the Timberwolves, pulling it out for the W. That was an incredible night of hoops, a tremendous finish. They waited until the very last moment to seal it. And so many times we see these close games won by the home team. And now let's check in with Allie LaForce with the player of the game. Allie. I'm here with Carl Anthony Towns and Carl it was a bit of a shootout out there but you got it done. How special to you was this win. I mean it was big for a team that shoots threes like they do. It's about continuing to just keep playing hard and uh, find ways to win and we found a way to win tonight. It's all about finding a way. Thanks Kat. Thanks Allie. Great interview once again. And that'll do it folks. For Grant Hill, Allie LaForce, and Clark Kellogg, this is Brian Anderson thanking you all for tuning in tonight, and we'll see you next time.